I've been staying up with Letting Me Dead for days now, and I, I just don't know. I swear she just arises from her slumber. Look, there she is now. What? Why is she washing her hands? I cannot say. Blood won't come off. It won't come off. What is this blood she's speaking of? It must be a mistake. Oh, she carries a burden on her heart. One far from what I've been trained to carry. I can't hear. I can't hear with all this ringing. Will she sleep? Hopefully. Hopefully, indeed. What evil must she harbor in such nightmares like this? Our allies draw near. I hear Malcolm, Cyborg, and McDuff lead the charge. Yes, they draw close to the Burnham asteroids. A key point to meet them. Does Donald Vader is out of their army? No. And what of Macbeth's sport? Strongly fortified the rumors spreading of his madness. His guilt must be reaching his psyche, even his army knows of it, but yearn for credits in their pockets. Prepare for light speed. His evil will soon end. Bring me no points. I only care if the asteroids move. I have no fears. Only a star-born child can hurt me. <laughs> Not even the Republic draws fear from me. And Sir, why do you interrupt me? Sir, I've seen 10,000. Hurry your tongue. I've seen 10,000 ships, sir. What weaklings would try to advance on me? I've seen the Republic, sir. Lead me your services through. See, see, I say. I'm sick at heart, my way of life is challenged, and by what? Old age? A troop of friends? How can my heart stand this seat? Yes, my lord. Is this true? Yes, they have on the planet, and soon our port. <sighs> then I'll fight to the bitter end. Send for my ships, my soldiers, uh, and my saint. And what of your wife? Hmm, whatever. She cannot be cured of her ailment. Have you tried? Beyond my medical expertise. Then why do I keep you if you cannot cure my wife? And where is my saber? Either you find it, the disease and cure it, or I'll dispose of you properly. I have no time for any of this trials. The Republic scoundrels draw near. I'll take your words to heart. Huh. Death. I bear no belief in it. That's what separates me from you, my brother. It is a belief that I believe in very much. A belief that keeps me here. Then our fleet draws near. I have no doubt. What field is before us? Burnham asteroids. I have an idea. Send word out to the fleet. Watch onto any asteroid small enough and drag it with you to conceal our numbers. Macbeth keeps still in his fort. It is his only hope. Those walls hold all his confidence, all his guilt. Would our power be enough to overthrow his evil? Time approaches. Prepare for war! Their siege will surmount to nothing. Who makes that noise? Women, my lord. I almost forgot the taste of beer. <laughs> Long ago, it awoke me from my slumber. But now, the blood of my hands and my thoughts has inspired me from that ancient emotion. The Empress is dead, my lord. Uh, and she was bound to die anyway. Uh, her evil will bear no words for me, no words from any man. She will signify nothing with her death. Uh, why do you come again? Sir, I come to strange woman. What? Omen. Oh, As I was staring out the window, I saw this, the asteroids that began to move towards the starship. Liar! Sir, it's not lies. If you're wrong, I will throw you into the vacuum space and laugh at you as you gasp for air. <laughs> We draw near, detach our rocks of burden, our screen, and prepare to lead the charge on evil. Success is at hand if our plan works. And if we lose, we will lose with our life, fighting to the end. Fire the flares. Let the Empire know that we have a war. Ha! Nowhere to run. I'm invincible. I can only be killed by a starboard child. Speak your name. Ha! As you can bear it. I fear only the fires of hell. My name is True Evil. My name is Macbeth. Then you would die, tyrant. Where's the tyrant? Where's Macbeth? These are
Public Fools, they both know for it. Turn, damn you! No, you turn and flee like the others. I'm tired of this childish game. No, I will stand and fight. Huh. Well, my brother, fight and shout. Necessary. I hope your son and McDuff arrive soon. Sir, I have troubling news. Your son has died facing off against the tyrant. He was a true warrior. He fought bravely and died honorably. The deed is done. The tyrant's head is ours. All hail the Republic! Let us not forget the loved ones we have lost, but not forget the soldiers here who helped strip the Empire of its evil. All hail the Republic. All, All hail, hail the Republic! Republic. Oh, the lives we've lost. But necessary. I hope your son and McDuff arrive soon. Sir, I have troubling news. Your son has died from a... Oh, the lives we've lost. But necessary. I hope your son and McDuff arrive soon. Yeah, we really should wait for the rest of them. <laughs> we have triumphed! The deed is done! All hail the Republic! Uh... 